friends. Welcome, welcome. So today I have something brand new. Um, this is the Found Objects Challenge for Thunder Horse Descendant. And uh, yeah, I've been trying, I'm trying it for the first time. So from what I understand, you get some, um, some beads and components that might be uh, like already made, like a necklace that you tear apart and basically Found Objects Challenge. So I am super excited to uh, get into this one. And look how cute the packaging is. Can I just say, this is the first time I've done this and um, look at the packaging. It is just adorable. Okay, so we will pull this out. Oh, look how cute. Oh my goodness. You know, I've never really ordered from Thunder Horse Ascendant and I have to tell you. Oh my God, thank you for a wonderful beating day. I'm not sure what the coupon is for, but there's my invoice. And then I also get uh, a, a business card for Randy, which is amazing. I will put that in with my contacts. And here we are. And it says Happy Mail. So let's pull that out first. Oh my goodness. This is, and it's all color coordinated. This is amazing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, another card. And this is basically our information, the May 2024 Found Objects Challenge. And look at the prize, guys. $50 worth of beady goodness from Taylor's Falls. And I have seen some of the beads from Taylor's Falls, and they're amazing. Um, you also get a beading book and an entry into the next month's challenge. That's fabulous. And guys, these bags are only $8.30. I mean, come on. And if you've never ordered from Randy before, um, and when you sign up, you will also get a coupon for your first order will have free shipping. So I got free shipping on this. So this was just $8.30. So the challenge here is embrace the challenge to expand your designing skills. Your creativity is the key. Make it cool and fun. Take time to explore your bag, research and plan your design. Tune into the Morning Coffee Live on your YouTube for discussions and inspiration. So we have to take a picture, sketch your design in your design book. Now I don't, I don't usually do that. I'm not a sketcher. So I will skip that part. Share your progress and stories. And here in the Thunder Descendant group on Facebook. So guys, if you're not a part of that, um, and then it just gives you the requirements to gain a ducky and then you get to be in the race. So that's amazing. All right. So let's look at our beads. Oh my goodness. And what is this? we get a little free gift oh those are so pretty just a little pair of just a little set of beads that will be perfect in some earrings those are beautiful thank you for that free gift i love that i love that so guys this is um i just got a new desk for recording and i'm just trying out a new setup to see if it works for me um so if i'm shaky or you things are off just just bear with me because we are gonna make this happen, okay? We are gonna do it this time. All right, so let's open up our little bag and see what we have. Okay, okay. That is, that is quite the challenge. <laughs> it sure is. Oh boy, <laughs> Randy's not playing around, man. She wants us to, to get it together. So let's see what we have here. We've got some of these. Uh, large hole beads, which they don't feel like wood. They feel a little heavier than wood. So we got these large kind of po larger pony type beads. They're not bad. They're not bad. And different colors, which is really nice because you can kind of pick through the colors. You don't have to use all the colors. Now these, of course, are wooden beads. I like wooden beads. And then here we have some lobsters. That's a lot of lobsters. I don't know how many necklaces I'm supposed to make, but that's a lot. <laughs> oh, th well, this is an interesting bag. I can't really, t I'm not really sure what this is, to be honest. If I can find the opening, there we go. ASMR, people, ASMR. Okay. What is this? Okay, so this is a bracelet blank. All right. It's a little, uh, yeah, it's, that's a bracelet blank. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Okay, that's interesting. That's inter That's definitely interesting. And then we have some, oh, there's little smiley faces. Guys, you see the little smileys on there? 
let's see what we got going on in here. I am not going to uh, be putting it together today. I just wanted to shoot the video so you guys can see what I got. Because um, this is going to require <laughs> some, some intense thinking. Because, you know, this is new for me and I want to do a good job. And that's an interesting. That's interesting. And then this is a little wood guy. He's kind of interesting. Um, I can def like my my gears are spinning. My gears are spinning. I'm having thoughts. I, I have to read over the rules and see aren't those adorable and see uh, how many of these beads that I have to use. Um, and then we have these larger chunky metal guys. Cool. So there is my found objects challenge, guys. Uh, and yeah, so <laughs> this is going to be a challenge for sure, but, um, I love, I love a good challenge. So this is going to be heck of fun. And uh, I want to appreciate, I want to thank Randy and tell her I appreciate everything that she does over there at Thunder Horse Descendant. Um, I know she does a lot of amazing things and I'm going to try to follow more of what's going on over there because it's a wonderful community. And whenever I'm over there, that community is just, it's it's just a really nice bunch of people so so yeah found objects challenge and guys uh i will when i have an idea i will shoot another video okay thank you so much for hanging out with me today i appreciate you bye bye